Ask an art advisor, is art a bubble? Are NFTs art? Nowadays, top gatherers will quite often depend on craftsmanship counselors for direction with regards to what they ought to or shouldn't buy and one of the better realized names is the New York-based specialist Lisa Schiff. Ms. Schiff, who considered Leonardo DiCaprio a client until a couple of years prior, has been doing business starting around 2002 and presently has an office in Tribeca that serves as a show and creation space for specialists. In a new telephone interview, Ms. Schiff talked about the impact of the pandemic on her business, the NFT frenzy and the condition of the worldwide craftsmanship market. This discussion has been altered and consolidated. How has the pandemic impacted business? A great deal of my clients purchased more houses and begun remodeling them, so they had more unfilled dividers. That gave a great deal of business. The pandemic likewise pushed us all truly far into the internet-based area. What are the ramifications of that? I currently see two methods of significant worth making, a conventional framework and another framework, where speculation esteem and basic and tasteful qualities get isolated and the workmanship is lost. Customary worth-making occurs over numerous lifetimes, as a craftsman goes through a lot of agreement making benchmarks, different specialists, keepers, establishments, scholastics, authorities. Over the long haul, a few craftsmen and a portion of their works of art climb into blue chip. Today, it's very confounding. Certain sale houses are imitating the collectibles market. Everything is a tchotchke to flip. Evening deals are for stuff that those bartering houses realize they can benefit on this week. You have shoes, dinosaur bones, some NFTs, 50 specialists you've never known about, and afterward three craftsmen who really ought to be in a night deal. This is truly upsetting. I don't have the foggiest idea how I can pay $3 million for a craftsman who's 30 years of age and has no historical center shows. I'm scared about this bizarre commercial center that depends on only data and prattle. So where are we heading? We're going into a truly hazardous area since this has motivated an entire host of new monetary instruments. The new financial framework does their own evaluations in light of what's exchanging its sell-off today. What do you think about Beeple, who sold an NFT at Christie's for $69 million last year? That is not craftsmanship. That is something else. For what reason is that not craftsmanship? The second that the sole capability of your prosperity depends on the thing somebody will pay, it's completely separated from any stylish and basic worth. NFTs, by the idea of how you characterize them, take the workmanship out. I don't dislike the additioning of computerized craftsmanship or requiring it to be safer in a blockchain. I definitely dislike something being fastened promptly to the amount it's selling for. Incidentally, I trade NFTs. I simply don't view at them as craftsmanship, I'm betting. You're a craftsmanship counselor, however you likewise sell workmanship that your clients own. Isn't that an irreconcilable situation? I treat them as totally different organizations. I have clients who sell things. I can't offer my clients things to my different clients, since then I'm addressing the two sides. You must be straightforward. How was it exhorting Mr. DiCaprio? It was a gigantic treat. He is 1,000% a genuine authority. He gathers dinosaur bones, stuff from excursions and voyages, miscellaneous items. Might you at any point give instances of craftsmen he enjoys? Camillo Restrepo from Colombia, who had shows at Steve Turner in L.A. I couldn't have ever taken a gander at Camillo Restrepo if not for Leo. I saw the work through his eyes and cherished it. Craftsmanship costs appear to simply continue onward up, especially with regards to blue-chip workmanship. Is workmanship an air pocket? The present moment, it is in no way, shape or form. These four specialists are having an air pocket, yet these 1,000 craftsmen are having a drop. I tell new gatherers, art isn't fluid. In the event that you feel like you could have to get your cash out for a crisis, don't gather craftsmanship in light of the fact that your transactable window is similar to about 14 days in length capricious. What's more, when it's not there, don't attempt to sell. However, everyone does, and they disdain it, and they're angry.